What's up, crew? Welcome to another video. My name is John Connie, aka Big Man Syndrome, and uh, if you're not a part of the crew, well, uh. Oh, the comeback struggle is real! Man, I really thought. I'm gonna turn this fan off really quick because we don't need that noise. I really, really thought when I posted that uh, fall, fell off the horse, time to get back up in the aim, am. I thought I was gonna be able to just snap my fingers and get going, and oh man, that is not the truth at all. It's, it's, it's taking a little bit of time. You see, it was, uh, this was Tuesday, and we had just finished putting up the really, 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 really heavy slat walls, and I thought, you know what, I can pick up the camera, I can do this, and if you've been following along, I had just said that I needed to put the 30 day challenge on pause, and I had some weird thoughts about what that really meant at this point. My God, crew, it has been a couple days, like literally. And I don't know when I'm gonna start editing. I'm gonna try to edit some vlog, maybe, maybe right now ish. I got uh, one of the other guys from Rock Tape is here, and we're gonna try to finish off these slat walls, which are really cool. Like to be honest, I mean, why not? Why not use this time to show what we built here? We got huge truss, which basically built <laughs> me and one other person, which is usually the case. And then I did all the banners, all the zip ties. As I don't even know if I can focus on like their beat up. All these slat walls, which is gonna be product and signage. Got two benches, which one side is gonna be for free taping with rock tape they do every year. The other side is gonna be for trying on assassins. And then really, really professional, which is super cool. This is like, this is probably the most professional and clean that this booth has ever looked. Uh, you got kiosks. You got kiosks over there for checking out. Really, really cool. But I guess I'll show you from the outside. So, almost done. We're waiting for two more uh, ladies to get back to help us finish off everything. And then my part is just about done and I can start focusing on the footage part. I'm gonna be shooting something funny with Neil, so stay tuned for that on the Rock Tape page. Welcome to the crib. And then, all weekend, it's shooting some athletes. I think I shot that like maybe maybe noon, maybe 10 in the morning because those walls didn't really take so long but they were just super heavy and I thought you know I could probably continue this for the day I could figure out what the you know pause meant because building the booth just took it all out of me and then uh, for whatever reason I just didn't pick up the camera for the rest of the day so I ended up getting to the hotel and just recording this oh <sighs> all right crew here's the thing I feel really bad about this and I'm semi annoyed that I'm even sharing this or even decided this. Very, very not inspirational, very, very not inspirational, not motivating and I feel bad because I know a lot of you guys have joined the, the challenge with me. Uh, what is happening right now is I need to pause for yesterday and today. I literally, literally, cannot do anything physical other than what I've been doing for the booth. And some of the time lapses, I, I think I should be visible with what I was carrying around, what I was doing. The truss system is not super heavy, but it's awkward. So I'm stiff. Like I tried to do Ramwa this morning. I couldn't even touch my toes and I'm very flexible as most of you know. I think it would be best for me uh, in order to stay healthy, in order to stay away from not being able to, you know, actually do my job tomorrow through uh, the end of the week, but again challenge myself to fail better. I can justify I can think of so many different justifications at the end of the day It's I'm pausing it All right with that behind us knowing that there was a slight failure and I needed to reprioritize things and figure out what I was doing Back home trying to get back into the swing of things. I wanted to leave the question for you guys of What should I do now going forward? I do have a trip to Vegas where my friend's turning 30 and that's obviously going to be quite the trip. But from now until then, I'm definitely going to be doing keto. I'm fasted right now and I'll be eating at 2 p.m. Uh, all I've had is uh, MCT oil coffee with some coconut oil. I hope that music isn't too loud. Going to jump into this workout. we got some thrusters, some calorie row, uh, strict pull-ups, which are interesting. I just did two and I feel pretty strong after doing the EDOD. The EDOD is halted, stopped. I haven't done any rounds of Cindy, uh, which is a bummer in my mind, but I, that's where I kind of wanted to put the question on you guys. 
because um, I'm, I'm not gonna restart a 30 day challenge. I know that I'm gonna be doing keto for the next two weeks for sure. Should I jump back on the EDOD? Like, what do you guys want me to do? I will if you want me to, but I know that I'm definitely not doing that EDOD in Vegas. There's gonna be some sleepless nights. If you know what I mean, because I, I love the tables. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see. Do you want me to continue the EDOD? I will continue it. And with that said too, comment yes and comment if you want me to start over or if you want me to just pick up at, I think we're on nine and we'll go from there. Content as usual. Today I mixed in what I shot that uh, on August 2nd. Tomorrow's video will be a full vlog from the games because I did do a little Vendor Village run around and I just didn't have time to edit both Rock Tape stuff and my own stuff. So I left it until now. We might just start that video as if it was there. It's gonna be like a flash to the past uh, for tomorrow's video. So look out for that and uh, fitness montage. <laughs> Well, crew, forgot my mic. <laughs> you know what? I don't care. Yeah, you know, whatever, whatever. Probably ain't gonna sound that great. I'm gonna roll up my windows, make sure my air conditioning's flowing enough to where it doesn't mess up the audio, but I cool off a little bit at least. That's it pretty much for today. I just wanted to, you know, create a little bit of content. And I, I went back and forth with how I wanted to do this. Like I wrote this whole script out with the idea of like having a bad dream and showing bits and pieces of content from the, I think there's three three days that I ended up taking the camera out for a little bit. I ultimately decided not to do that. One, because I'm not sure that type of content really goes, whoa, that's a, that's a lens flare. I'm never really sure how well that type of content goes on this channel as far as like putting together a fake storyline, scripting things, and then, um, sort of constructing the story around uh, a past event. And two, I realized that August 3rd, I shot enough to make a real vlog and I shouldn't negate the fact that that occurred. That's a long enough explanation for that. Ultimately just decided that I was gonna make them their own vlogs. Today I incorporated it in sort of what I'm doing today and that was working out. And then I wanted to sort of follow up on the pause slash cancellation of the 30 day challenge. I really can't say that I'm pausing it because I don't think I'm ever gonna really restart it unless after Vegas I decide to get shit back together and do a 30 day challenge again. And then like I said in today's video, you want me to continue to do the EDOD. I don't know. In my mind, I don't know that I would necessarily want to do it, but if you guys feel like I should do it out of principle, which sounds silly, let me know. I will do it. I will definitely finish it off because I did like the idea of having this, like I, my pull-ups feel as strong as they ever have. And I know that's from doing pull-ups every day uh, in that structure. I think that's about it. Again, tomorrow will be a, a vlog from the past. So it'll be my, I think it was Wednesday at, no, yes. No, yes, no, yes. Thursday, was it Wednesday? I think it was Wednesday, August 3rd. Uh, so I'll be just showing that entire thing because that was the, really the main reason why I didn't want to do the story or like the script because that 
was enough content to create a video of its own. I didn't want to skip over or glaze over too many of the things. I uh, got my body fat percentage checked. I did the uh, handstand walk obstacle by, I don't even remember what the name of the company is, Array. I rode the Echo Bike, and then that's what happened. The next day I had the challenge with Matt Bickle, uh, which I think I'll just end up including in the end of that vlog, depending on how long it takes, or I'll end up doing what I did with today's video, and I'll incorporate it in sort of this, you know, quick vlog of like, hey, this happened sort of thing. Tomorrow, I will probably not be vlogging a present day vlog. It will be all from August 3rd at the game. So keep an eye out for that. And uh, basically that's it for today, folks. I'm picking up Dylan from daycare. If you enjoyed today's video, let me know by hitting that like button, leave a comment, share this video, because of course those are the ways that help grow the crew. And then until the next one, I'll see you later, crew. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I gotta figure out how to end these videos. And I kinda wanted to back into this spot because I'm gonna go that way. Instincts going no looking bad like a bat with an eye patch. All black through the woods with a backpack and a lit match. Spark one time, get the whole city looking like a dark set of orange when I burn it down. What it is, what it do, whole click in live. I'm the talk of the town. I'm a city, had a mouth and it wouldn't shut up.